Hey there, my name is Zanaid. Welcome to Reflections on Creation Week. And of course, there is another wonderful lesson in store for you. On the sixth day, God created thousands of different animals, and He also created humans. Then God told Adam and Eve something really special. He said, I am putting you in charge of the fish, the birds, and all the animals. So from the very beginning of this world, God told Adam and Eve that they were to take care of the earth and He expects us to do the same. God has provided an amazing world and we are the stewards or caretakers of it. So here are a few suggestions to help us care for the earth. Water is very important and precious, so we have to be careful of how much water we use. Turn off the tap while brushing your teeth and take shorter showers because every drop counts. Do you know how amazing our lungs are? They do an amazing job. They bring in fresh air filled with oxygen and get rid of the carbon dioxide from your body. It's like they're your body's cleaners. They make sure we always have the oxygen we need to play, run, bath, and do all the fun things we love to do. Trees are like Earth's lungs. They give us oxygen to breathe. So if you plant a tree, it will be a wonderful way to help care for the Earth. We also have to care for the rivers and seas. So we have to be careful not to dump garbage in them. Some of our garbage can trap and kill fish, turtles, and other water creatures. You might just be one person, but your actions matter a lot. Every time you choose to save water, plant a tree, or dispose of your garbage safely, you're making our earth is a, a better place. It's like planting seeds of happiness that grow into a greener, happier world. So whenever you think of day number six of creation, remember God wants us to take care of the things of nature. Let us pray. Father in heaven, we thank you for this beautiful world you have created for us. We pray that you would help us to take care of the things of nature. In Jesus' name we pray with thanks. Amen.